when we ask the question, where do we find God, whether in coronavirus or in any other situation, the answer I think has to be that we see God most clearly in the face of Jesus Christ. That's the place where we see the most perfect picture of what God is like, his heart, his actions, his character. And so therefore, in the middle of this crisis of coronavirus, it seems to me that where we find God is where we see the most Christ-like moments or impulses or actions or behaviours that we see around us. So, for example, we know that Christ healed the sick. Uh, and whenever we see someone come through coronavirus, having gone through the uh, the pain of that um, uh, of this virus and come through the other end with the healing power of the body, we see something of God's healing power uh, at work there. We know that Christ reached out with compassion uh, to those who were sick, to those who were poor. And so wherever we see those acts of compassion, whether it's people in the NHS with nurses or doctors uh, seeking to treat people with just simple compassion and kindness, that's something of where we see God there. Uh, we know that Christ sacrificed himself for us. And so where we see people sacrificing, risking their own lives, lives to care for others. That's where something, that's where we see something of God in this. Uh, we know that Christ prayed to his Father and where the church prays uh, for other people, praying for health and protection and grace uh, in this situation, that's where we see God at work. We know that Christ cared for the poor and so actions done in the name of Christ, whether it's churches reaching out to their local communities with food parcels to the vulnerable or the elderly or food banks to those who are going without food, that's where we see the, the, the face of, of God. All of these things, whether we know it or not, are inspired by the God of Jesus Christ who made us. And it's in these very things that we find God in the middle of coronavirus.